Here to brighten our day with standout summer colors is Lynn Spence. <laughs> All right, Lynn. We're talking bold color, one of my favorite topics now, but if you're trying to mix them, are there rules? Can you just go to town and have fun? I think it's an adventure, mm -hmm. often it's not. Um, I will say to you that you look beautiful today. Um, I think the yellow is exquisite. I'm having fun. But generally speaking, yellow is an ambiguous color. Okay. Because it can be on the tone of green and it can be orange and it can have a bit of red and so on and so forth. Mm -hmm. It can be a pinkishy tone. And it doesn't suit everybody. True. It does not suit everybody. Yes. So I think that sometimes later on in the segment, you'll see how we can do yellow, but add it to something else. And then it is spectacular. Yes, because a lot of people are going to see this and be like, absolutely not. Great on her, but I could never. So you're going to show us how maybe you can do you your can toe. Do maybe it. you can. But exactly. first, we want to start with your first look, which is like, all of the same color in one color family. Exactly. So let's exactly. see what that is with Eve. Come on out, Eve. Ooh, it's all about the green. And it's all about green. And I will tell you, Tracy, that green is an exceptional color yeah. because it likes to be paired with other versions and, and variations of the color. Okay. So you could yeah. literally do bottle green with this and you could do a lime green and a chartreuse and it would always work so beautifully together. So I'm just going to show you that you could do Oh, that's nice. You could do this. Yeah. And what I love about a little suit like this from Winners is that I can take this right through to fall with just a little sweater. Right. Which is great. Yeah. But I want to show you something else which I think is fantastic. I want to take that same blazer and I want to pair it with Ooh, I love that little, matching set. Isn't that cute? That and I would cute. do that with the blazer. Yeah. And look at all the varieties of green in there, but then it's tempered with a little bit of that beautiful purpley plummy color. Beautiful. Quite interesting. So so green is a very very interesting color to choose. But yeah. here's something else that's great. But you could also pair it with, with colors like copper. Yes, that's beautiful. How fabulous that is. And look at what this jacket looks like when you pair it with the green pant. Oh, that's lovely. Like how fabulous that is, right? So it's about having fun. It's about knowing that you can do green on green on green and all the different kinds of greens are going to work together, exactly. which is lovely. With hints of something else often natural again. Beautiful. Eve, thank you so much. That was lovely. <laughs> You come right out this way. There you go. Thank you. Love that. Okay, next, what color do we have? Let's ooh, bring Sophia ooh, ooh, out. Ooh. Oh, tangerine, baby. It's lovely, isn't it? Tangerine dream. Isn't that gorgeous? Gorgeous. So I will say to you that I have I choose this color often because it's gold-based. Yeah. And what I love about it is that it's warm. Yes, it is. And so I think that when you look at this. It's a caftan, you go, there's a lot of color there, but the drapiness of that satiny fabric yeah. makes it look very sumptuous. Mm -hmm. So sometimes the fabric also Counts. is very important. Yeah. And then it's got slits on the side, so I paired it with a great satiny pair of camel pants. Lovely. This, by the way, is all H&M, and they do such a great job with color, particularly this season. Mm -hmm. But I will show you something else, and I'm gonna take your beautiful bag, and I will show you this which I think you're gonna love and that is by taking a dress that is a wrap dress okay. that you might say I that's not me I don't know mm -hmm. and instead of doing this oh wow so super drapey so really luxurious like a dress instead yeah and my robe my beautiful my beautiful topper yeah and all of a sudden I'm going to wear this now. I'm not going right. to say that's just for the pool party. No. That's just for lounging around the house. Yeah. Oh, I get this now. I feel this. Yeah. And I think it's because there's a neutral with the orange and it feels really rich and gorgeous. Can I just show you one more thing? Do you know what else looks great with it? What? Purple looks beautiful. That with looks orange. like royalty. royalty. Sophia, thank you so much. Stunning. That's fantastic. Thank you. Good stuff. So all the colors working together, but we are having a real moment right now with Barbie Pink. Let's get Catherine out here. Okay. Come on, Barbie. Let's go party. So, so Rita has done it. this beautiful, beautiful um, grouping, and this is by this is by Rita the Bird's Papaya. 
Yes. Uh, birds. Yes, the birds papaya. Birds papaya. Yeah, yeah. And, and she has done an incredible line with Reitman's. She did. But what I love about that is the saturation of this pink. It's and, and the eyelet. And the eyelet. It's and the really. eyelet is so great because it's huge for the season, but it also yeah. holds color really, really well. Yes. That is a standalone color. It is. It's a cosmetic color. It looks great on almost every skin tone in the world. Mm -hmm. And so it's on the short side for, and it will be on a lot of girls. I want you to wear this a lot. You're going to wear this like a little bit of a three quarter, yeah. and you're going to wear it with a floral pant. This so one do is it from as a Winters. tunic. Do it, so as, do a it dress. as a tunic. Yeah. Think about a great little white jean jacket. This mm -hmm. one from Joe Fresh. Think about doing this with a pair of faded denim jeans. Nice. It looks great with faded, absolutely beautiful, but the color stands strong. Yes. And so it tends to like to be with bits of the pink, but not all over pink. It's really lovely, and it is a nice way to break it up. Um, if you don't just want to wear the dress by itself, that's Sarah Landry. Um, that she's the she's a papaya. clever girl. She did a good collection. Catherine, thank you so much. That's lovely. Very nice. Okay, last up, we have our model, Jen, and she's showing us, come on out, Jen, how to mix and match colors and look stunning. So, full circle moment. We went from bold yellow right? to, an, it, to like a mixed yellow. So there's the yellow again, very similar. Yeah. It might be a little bit more lemony, mm -hmm. but doing it with the blue, which could be a little bit military, if you will, yeah. I think that the combination is incredible in the paisley, which would normally be maybe a little bit French Provencal, yeah. but when you do it this way with bold, then it becomes preppy. Yes. And really cool. So I did this with a shirt in the yellow and the blue. By the way, this is all from Spanner. And my little orange bag is from Zara. And nice. pulling, if you're going to pull a color out, pull the tiniest amount of the color yes. as your accessory. And it will look, look best. And then you know what? Oh, I could do a little jean jacket with Ooh, that. That's hot that stuff. That would be hot stuff. Cute. It's adorable, very cute. Right? And yes. we want to see like the whole rainbow. If we Yay. get all the models in here, let's show all the colors together. They're beautiful and bold. Come on in. It's just like, it's a perfect little color family. <laughs> Lynn, thank you so much for that. Great job.